APICA Cardiovascular was incorporated in 2010 with the aim of developing an access and closure system for use in transapical TAVI procedures. The technology was originally conceived as part of an APICA aortic conduit that was developed at Georgia Tech in the US, but its applicability to TAVI and LVAT procedures quickly became evident. The company set up in Ireland in early 2011 to develop the technology. Along the way, we have made use of the excellent network of medical device service providers locally, which has been of huge advantage to us as we have advanced the technology. Our aim is to gain CE mark and bring to market, whilst extending the technology to other applications and building a product range in the process. The APICA access and closure device is a world's first. There is no other transapical closure system that has completed its clinical trial to date. Our device has achieved 100% technical success in its clinical trial. Skin-to-skin -skin time for the TAVI procedure is now approximately 60 minutes, down from 90 minutes with suture-based closure. Average blood loss has been reduced from 3.6 units to 0.8 units. When you consider that in the US, the cost of one pack of packed red blood cells is $200, and the total cost of transfusing a patient can be up to $2,400, the economic benefit of the APICA device is significant. In addition, with reduced complication rates, it is clear that this technology represents a significant advance over the current state of the art. We continue to maintain a very close relationship with our clinical partners. They represent indispensable partners in the development of this technology since they have helped us to identify the original clinical need and helped us to fine tune the device as we advance to first in man use. Those same physicians then became the centres for our clinical trial this year. In APICA, we recognise that innovation is not limited to the products we design, it is part of everything that we do. We are still just six full-time employees, so we are very adaptable in our approach to problems and challenges. It is also very easy to maintain a two-way information flow throughout the organisation, so that new ideas are always heard. We have been very conscious of fostering an environment where people are free to try out new ideas and where failure is never viewed as failure. The decision to locate APICA in Ireland did not happen by accident. On our doorstep, we have a range of key service providers that we were able to tap into right from the start. This allowed us to progress the project at a rapid rate so that the concept was proven in an animal model as early as possible. The availability of experienced and talented personnel was key as we looked to build our team into the future. 2012 represents a very successful year for us with the completion of the clinical phase of our project, and it was this that prompted us to enter the awards programme.